So when we get on a roller coaster, for instance, right. we want to be at the upper level of that euthymic window. So we take that homeostasis and we tilt it in this direction. So we give ourselves a, um, a safe and calculated thrill that just verges on trauma, but it doesn't. Right. So okay. Let's, um, we're going to stop in just a second. I'm not, I've got some other things I've got to go, go and do. Uh, but right now, I just want to say that, yeah, we're, we're pushing up to that, that, that limit that we can manage for the thrill of it. Okay. I also think there's another side to this we didn't really get to talk, talk about, and that, that has to do with the developmental level of the person that we're talking about. And, um, um, you know, teenagers going to horror movies and laughing throughout, it comes to mind. And I, I wanted to talk with him more about that. And I, I probably will get a chance to at some point, too. But um, right now we're going we're gonna to wrap it up. But let me give you that shot of uh, 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 Dr. Rose. Uh, he looks like, almost like he's saluting, but his hand is a little limp on this other arm. And um, I don't know if he's scratching something above his eye. Um, I don't, I don't know if those hands are ever going to come together and make a sound, or you know, it, are we supposed to look through the hands? If, what are we doing there? I just, uh, I just, <laughs> I don't know. That was my, uh, that was my comedy routine for today. Thank you guys for watching. I'm in the studio all the time. If you're seeing this. You probably need to come down to First Avenue and come in and let's talk and uh, figure out what's going on because um, I'm having a lot of fun and I hope you will join me and let's have some fun together. All right, I'll see you next time.